Welcome to a journey back in time, to an era when housekeeping was an art, and wisdom was passed down through generations. Today, we'll uncover 20 vintage housekeeping tips from grandma that still hold surprising relevance. These old-fashioned tricks might just revolutionize the way you manage your home. Tip 1. Newspaper Window Cleaner Grandma's windows were the envy of the neighborhood, sparkling without a smear in sight, all thanks to her trusty stash of old newspapers. Unlike modern paper towels that can leave lint or streaks, newspaper paired with a homemade solution of equal parts water and vinegar offers a streak-free shine. The slightly abrasive texture of the newspaper works in harmony with the vinegar's acidic properties to cut through grime and leave windows gleaming. Tip 2. Lemon for Water Stains Those stubborn water stains on metal faucets didn't stand a chance in Grandma's house. With just a simple lemon, she tackled the problem with ease. The citric acid in lemons is a natural shielding agent, which helps in breaking down the mineral deposits causing the stains. Cut a lemon in half, rub it on the stains, and watch as the natural acidity works its magic, leaving your fixtures shiny and clean. Tip 3. Baking Soda Carpet Freshener Long before the days of store-bought carpet deodorizers, Grandma was sprinkling baking soda on her carpets to keep them fresh and odor-free. Baking soda is a natural odor absorber. By generously sprinkling it over your carpet, letting it sit to absorb odors and then vacuuming it up, you're not just freshening your carpets but also deodorizing your entire living space naturally. Tip 4. Salt for Iron Cleaning Grandma kept her iron in pristine condition without the need for expensive solutions. A simple kitchen staple, salt, was her secret. By sprinkling salt on a piece of paper and running the hot iron over it, the salt acts as a mild abrasive, cleaning the iron plate effectively. This method is gentle, preventing damage to the iron while ensuring it's clean and smooth for flawless pressing. Tip 5. Vinegar for Fabric Softener We'll get to that in a second. I have a favor to ask of you. If you like this video so far, please subscribe to the channel. Grandma's laundry was soft and fresh without today's chemical-laden fabric softeners. She knew the secret was in a pantry staple, white vinegar. Adding half a cup of white vinegar to the washing machine's rinse cycle softens fabric, reduces static cling, and even helps break down laundry detergent residue. It's a natural and eco-friendly alternative that harkens back to simpler times. Tip 6. Olive Oil Furniture Polish The warm glow of well-maintained wood furniture in Grandma's home was thanks to a simple concoction of olive oil and lemon juice. This mixture not only cleans the wood but also nourishes it, keeping it hydrated and extending its life. The lemon juice adds a clean scent and helps in removing any sticky residue, while the olive oil gives a natural, chemical-free polish. Tip 7. Potato for Rust Removal Grandma didn't let a little rust on pans or tools get her down. She used a potato cut in half, dipped in baking soda. The oxalic acid in potatoes combined with the abrasiveness of baking soda makes for an effective rust remover. It's a biodegradable, cost-effective, and chemical-free solution. Tip 8. Bread for Wall Cleaning Before the era of magic erasers, Grandma used a slice of white bread to remove fingerprints and smudges from walls. The bread acts like a sponge, gently lifting dirt without damaging the paint. This ingenious tip is a testament to Grandma's resourcefulness and her knack for finding cleaning solutions in the most unexpected places. Tip 9. Tea for Cleaning Hardwood Floors The secret to Grandma's gleaming hardwood floors was in her teapot. Brewed tea rich in tannic acid not only cleans the floor but also adds a beautiful shine. This method is gentle on hardwood floors preserving their natural beauty without the harshness of chemicals. Tip 10. Toothpaste for Silver Polish Grandma kept her silverware gleaming with a product found in every bathroom. Toothpaste. The mild abrasives in toothpaste make it perfect for polishing silverware without scratching it. It's a simple, readily available solution for maintaining the luster of your precious silver pieces. Tip 11. Flour Sack Towels for Lint-Free Drying Grandma swore by flour sack towels for drying dishes. Their tight weave and high absorbency make them perfect for leaving dishes lint-free. And especially glassware. Especially glassware. 
These towels are a nod to a time when every item in the household had multiple purposes and efficiency was key. Tip 12. Chalk for Grease Stains Grandma had a secret weapon for battling grease stains. Plain white chalk. Rubbing chalk on a grease stains before washing helps absorb the grease, making it easier to wash out. This simple natural solution saves clothes from ruin and keeps them looking their best. Tip 13. Banana Peel for Dusting Plants The inside of a banana peel was grandma's go-to for dusting and shining the leaves of houseplants. The natural oils in the banana peel not only clean but also add a shine to the leaves, keeping plants healthy and dust-free. It's a natural, chemical-free way to care for your indoor greenery. Tip 14. Rice for Cleaning Decanters Grandma's solution for cleaning narrow-neck decanters or vases was as clever as it was effective. Adding warm water, a dash of dish soap, and a handful of rice created a gentle, natural scrubber that could reach into the curves and crevices that brushes can which is that brushes can. Tip 15. Wax Paper for a Cleaner Fridge Grandma kept her refrigerator shelves spotless with a simple trick, lining them with wax paper. This not only makes cleaning up spills a breeze, but also protects the shelves from scratches and stain. It's a simple, time-saving hack for maintaining a clean fridge. Tip 16. Aluminum Foil for Scrubbing Pots Grandma turned a common kitchen item into a powerful cleaning tool. A ball of aluminum foil can scrub away the grime on pots and pans without scratching the surface. It's a testament to her ingenuity and a reminder that sometimes the best tools are already in our kitchen. Tip 17. Cornstarch for Window Cleaner Grandma's windows were kept sparkling clean with a concoction of cornstarch and water. The cornstarch acts as a mild abrasive helping to remove dirt and leaving windows spotless. This natural solution is effective, easy to make, and a nod to a time when homemade was always best. Tip 18. Vanilla extract for a fresh fridge. To combat unpleasant odors in the fridge, Grandma used a dab of vanilla extract on a cotton ball. It's a natural, pleasant way to keep your fridge smelling fresh without resorting to artificial deodorizers. Tip 19. Cucumber for stainless steel shine. Grandma knew how to keep her stainless steel appliances looking their best. A slice of cucumber can clean and polish stainless steel surfaces without leaving streaks or scratches. It's a gentle, natural way to maintain pristine look of your appliances. Tip 20. Wool Balls for Dryer Sheets Instead of chemical-laden dryer sheets, Grandma used wool balls in her dryer. The naturally softened clothes reduce static and can be used repeatedly, making them an eco-friendly cost-effective alternative to disposable dryer sheets. These vintage housekeeping tips are more than just quaint relics of the past. They're a testament to the wisdom of our grandmothers and the enduring power of simple natural solutions. As we incorporate these tips into our modern lives, we not only honor the legacy of our grandmothers, but also embrace a more sustainable, mindful approach to caring for our homes. So, the next time you're faced with a household challenge, remember that the answer might just lie in grandma's wise, time-tested advice. Hit that like button if you're inspired by these vintage tips, subscribe for more insights into a simpler, more natural way of living, and share in the comments which tip you're planning to try first. Here's to keeping our homes beautiful and well-loved, just like grandma did.